are looking rough. It is 9.30 on Monday. I didn't know till last night that Pete was off today. Usually they work and um, I thought, and he goes, no, no, I'm off. I'm like, oh, you never said. And he goes, sorry, I didn't say it. I said, no, it's no big deal, but it's like getting an extra Saturday. I woke up at 4.30 this morning. I didn't go downstairs till 5.30. And as I was going downstairs, Ash was just going out with Luna and taking Luna out. And then when the poor thing came in, she goes, I woke up with the worst migraine. So when you saw the video earlier, she did, didn't want to go back up to her room because she said it was so hot. But on top of it, last night, she was coughing and spluttering. And so she has a cold back and um, had the migraine on top. When she did roll over a little bit, I said, how are you feeling? She goes, my headache's not as, my migraine's gone. I'm not nauseous, but I still have a headache. As I like to say, it was downgraded to a headache, poor thing. But she's off today, which is a good thing. And Pete's off. He's in his office doing something on his computer. And uh, I didn't want it. Once Pete got up, I came up here, made the bed and just said I would edit my vlog up here, which I have done. And now I'm back on my Tastefully Simple site, having a look, seeing what else is out there. And I'm watching Crazy Bag Lady. Every time I vlog lately, I'm watching Crazy Bag Lady. I had a whole week's worth yesterday to catch up on. I've got to go back to John's and catch up and check on Maria and Steve and Shirley and everybody else I watch. I need to go over and have a look and see what's going on. Um, there's somebody else that keeps watching mine and I keep saying I'm coming, I'm coming and I haven't been over yet. So I want to go back and go over and visit some other people too. But I think it's going to be a fairly quiet day. I'll tell you what though, it is quite nice out. Um, the sun is shining and it's in the 40s. And I can really see through all the screens and everything, but is that, what is that? I tell you. Um, yeah, it's quite nice today. If I had the energy, I would clean my bedroom, but I don't. So let's just forget that. So if you see all the dust and stuff, just forgive me for today. I will get to it this week at some point. I just don't feel like it today. No desire. I want to see if I have more stuff I can list on Poshmark and um, see if I can make some deals with people, get people interested. There's a lot of likes on a lot of the handbags. So we'll see if we can get some. Pete have gone around the block. Good time to go down and get some Marmite on toast and a cup of coffee. And then I promise I'll shower. It's only quarter past ten, but I always feel so lazy, especially on a Monday. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, I feel like I should be up and ready because I am normally am by 7.30, 8 o'clock. Okay, Lynn, I'm going on this one on your say so. It's wanted. Okay. Found it. Right guys, I've got some energy. So I've made the sausage rolls. Hopefully they're not overdone. Don't know if you can even see them. Loon, Pete took Luna out again. Now she's in the bath. He's giving her a bath. Ash is upstairs. I think she's just chilling out. She took a bath herself. I've got beer bread in the oven because I fancy beer bread. And the other day I made it and then we never ate it and I ended up tossing it, which made me mad. So I'm going to make some. I think I'm gonna make this because I don't really want potatoes tonight. So I'm gonna make this pasta salad right now. And then I have to go switch the laundry because I'm running out of dark clothes and I need my jeans. Okay, I am absolutely knackered. It is quarter past seven. Just come upstairs to sit for like 15 minutes. I got laundry going, folded, done, put away. I made the sausage rolls. They actually are not burnt. They just look a little darker than I normally do them. They're actually delicious, so that's good. Check, check. Then I made the pasta salad. That's now sitting in the fridge, chilling. And I've just put the, the breads out. I made the beer bread. That is out. And I just put the steak in for dinner, which will take about half an hour. So I'm come up here. One, so I could get changed because I was in that big fuzzy sweater. And I am boiling. Ashley just came downstairs. She sounds so sick. Um, So she's downstairs now. Pete's watching the Daytona 500. Um, so I thought, well, I'm gonna come up here and have 
at least 15 minutes till the steak's cooked, 15, 20 minutes. And then I'll go down. Ash is not having steak, she doesn't fancy it. She's gonna have some of those buffalo wings, which will probably clear out her sinuses and help her a little bit. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's it really, guys. Um, Pete's mum, well, my sister-in-law texted us earlier, her little cat, Chester passed away today, so that's very sad. He, I think he was 19 or 20. Um, he hasn't been well, and he's been up and down, and then not really not been well since Thursday, so they took him in, and I just feel bad, because I've been thinking about Roxy. I keep calling Luna Roxy this weekend, and you just think about them, and I posted the pictures the other day, and, you know, it's not something that goes away when you're used to having a pet around for that long. Um... Yeah, he was a little runaway in Maine. And actually, when she first brought him back, they brought him over here thinking Ash could have him. But at that time, or still now, Pete is highly allergic to cats. So, um, yeah, little Chester. Rest in peace, little Chester. <sighs> Guys, I think I'm going to end it here because all I'm going to do now is have dinner, which is steak and pasta salad. And I have some green salad as well, but I don't know if I could even bend down to get it out of the fridge. I just have to be, I've been on my feet since 4.15. Just doing those few things takes time. And as you know, I only have a very small oven. So one thing goes in and I have to wait for that to come out to put the next in. So it's a long process. But I'm absolutely boiling. I'm tired. And my poor old back has had enough for one day. And I keep thinking it's Sunday and tomorrow's Monday, but it's not. Today was Monday and tomorrow's Tuesday, <laughs> what day comes after Monday? Let's have a think. Lynn, I have watched a couple. I'm on the third one of that wanted. Ooh, gets right into it, doesn't it? Yeah, you're right. It is a very good show. Um, a very good show, which reminds me, the other day I noticed that Good Girls was on TV. Now, did it tape? That is the ultimate question. My um, DVR seems to record what it wants, whether I've set it to or not. Come on, TV, on you go. Oh, because I've turned that off, haven't I? One, zero, zero, one. Let's see if it taped. Nope, it didn't. So I'm hoping... Netflix puts it up as it goes along. That's terrible. Blooming cheek. Stupid thing. Oh, 717. That means someone's thinking about me because it's my birthday. Who's thinking about me? Anyone? Right. Um, see, I don't get... Some things after it taped, but it didn't tape. And it had the big red record thing right next to it. So I have no idea. Drives me insane. But this is this Zoe's Extraordinary Playlist. Has anyone seen that? I had it set to tape the first one, which was on ages ago, the pilot. And then I was like, ah, forget it. And I deleted it. Well, then one day I was watching YouTube. This was a couple of weeks back. And I went to uh, watch somebody's thing. And it played the whole... It said... Um, new show coming out on whatever it was, um, NBC. Do you want to watch the whole thing? So I watched it. It was really funny. It's cute. So Zoe's Extraordinary Playlist. If anyone hasn't seen it, it's about a girl. And these songs come in her head. And then people around her start singing and dancing. Whatever's going on. Like, how do I explain it? Some, like if there's a situation, a song to go with that situation will come on in her head and then people around her start singing and dancing, but she's the only one that can see that happen. And it's really good. Anyway, watch it. <laughs> it's entertaining. It's entertainment. But yeah, I liked it. Um, all right, guys, that's it. I'm going to go now because I'm waffling. So I'm going to leave you for this evening because this is already five and a half minutes. Uh, just to say, Luna's had two walks around the block and she's been to the park and Pete just gave her a bath because he realised that she was all, her undercarriage was all dirty 
from running around at the park and probably laying down when the bigger dogs came around. But I said to Pete, I think every time she goes to the park, she, we're going to have to give her a bath because um, she's a very light colour. And then you've got dogs jumping on her and stuff. And she jumps on other dogs too, don't get me wrong. But it's muddy and dirty down there. And she does sleep in with Ashley, who has white bedding. So uh, not good. So she's had a bath. And Pete said she loved it. She goes, she jumped right in the bath and then starts drinking the water. But this is our first dog out of all of them that likes water. So that's good. It likes a bath. Anyway, I, I'm going to go now for real. So I'm going to love and leave you. I hope everyone had a wonderful Monday. Whatever it is you did today, I hope it was a good one. And we will definitely see you tomorrow. Good night, guys. Mm -hmm.